Now, you've all heard Churchill delivering the famous 4th of June 1940 speeches, we, speech, we shall fight them on the beaches. What you probably don't know is that the version that you've heard wasn't recorded in 1940. It was recorded in 1949 because Churchill actually didn't deliver that speech over the radio on 4th of June 1940. He delivered it in the House of Commons and in the evening a BBC announcer read out selections from it. Now there's another story which is entirely false that an actor called Norman Shelley actually delivered that speech uh, on Churchill's behalf. But in fact, that isn't the case because, as I say, nobody delivered it on 4th of June 1940. Now, here's a challenge for you. Go and find somebody who was alive during World War II. They'll probably be, they'll be in their 80s by now. And ask them if they remember Churchill's World War II speeches, and they will probably say yes. And when they say yes, say, all right, which one do you remember? And they'll almost certainly say, I remember the fight them on the beaches speech. Of course, they can't remember it from having heard it in June 1940 because Churchill didn't deliver it then. They can only remember the recording. But for some reason, it's very intriguing that this should be the case, people actually have these very strong and yet clearly false memories of having heard Churchill deliver that speech. It's not absolutely clear why that should be true, but I think you'll agree with me, and I hope that you will read my book and uh, see the the true story of how these speeches were received at the time, that the actual story of how Churchill's speeches were received is much more interesting than this oversimplified national myth that we, we have that everybody listened to the Fight Them on the Beaches speech on 4th of June 1940 and was instantly filled with total enthusiasm and inspiration.